these are a few tips on installing your foot strap into your windsurf board, kite surf board, surf board, sup board, even a jet ski, anything that uses these type of foot straps. The first is if your foot strap adjusts like this, have the water flowing over your foot strap to keep that closed. To me, that's backwards. That could open. That's the correct way around. The water flows over. Some foot straps have anti-twist systems here. This one doesn't, just for the purposes of demonstration. Typically, the screw is a six millimeter screw, self-tapping, stainless steel. In short, stainless steel, because you don't want a corrosion mark across your board. This, one, this screw is about 30 millimeters long. Position the screw over the hole in the foot strap plug of your board. Don't miss the hole in the foot strap plug, else you'll drive the screw into your board and need a repair. When it's positioned, grab your screwdriver and you want to be exerting a downward force plus a turning moment at the same time. And the reason you're doing that, you're compressing this part of the foot strap, you're compressing the EVA foam in the deck pad of the foot strap, so there's a high force. You can end up stripping the hole inside the foot strap plug. If that happens, This is the six millimeter screw that's typically in your foot strap. We have a seven millimeter screw. Worst comes to the worst, your pro repair guy can remove the plug from your board and, and replace it with something like this. This one is a two hole foot strap plug. This one is a five hole foot strap plug. One other thing on your screwdriver, typically these tips are a PZ2 for the modern windsurfing, surf, kite, stand-up boards. This tip, we break one at least every 12 months, or we wear them out. Rather than throw away your whole screwdriver, it's handy to have a removable tip that you can responsibly recycle.